Right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. Today you join me in Naples, in Italy, on board Motor Yacht Bina, which is a 43 meter Mondo Marine available for charter. So, in today's video, we're going to be doing a tour of the entire boat to showcase what charter guests can expect when chartering motor yacht Bina. So we're starting the tour here on the sun deck. As you can see, nice sun bathing area, lots of space, lots of volume, nice big jacuzzi. So if you've been doing some water sports, paddle boarding, wakeboarding, water skiing, whatever it might be, it's a fantastic place to come and chillax, have a cocktail or refreshment and just enjoy time on the water. As we make our way aft, we've got some additional sun beds here and then we have the nice big full service bar. So you can have your drinks here, cocktails, wine, champagne. So you make our way to the aft end on the sun deck here. Nice round table with that nice big barbecue so the chef can put beautiful barbecue on for the guests. Enjoy your meal here in the sun deck. You can imagine being at anchor in a beautiful bay, whether it be in Italy or the French Riviera or the Dalmatian coast in Croatia. What a place to spend your summer holiday on board Bina. That's the sun deck guys. We're gonna make our way now down to the bridge deck off. So down these nice teak steps, and immediately you can see this area is probably the most common area. This is where most guests will eat all their meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then you've got a nice lounge area here to relax with plenty of shade to protect you from that uh, hot summer sun. As we go inside the boat into the British Salon, we have Izzy. Hi everyone, welcome to Bina. Uh, this is our upper sky lounge. It's got a very nice homely feel to it, um, makes you feel very comfortable. Um, we've got the TV that pulls out here, which is great with the entertainment system for a nice movie night, if ever you would like one. And fully functioning bar, we like to do a lot of afternoon cocktails and breakfast service here. Um, so yeah, enjoy the rest of the boat, enjoy the rest of the tour, and hopefully we look forward to welcoming you on board. Izzy, thank you very much. Thank you. Right guys, we'll continue, we'll make our way forward here. And immediately on the left, we do have a day head. Lots of space, lots of nice marble wall they built the boat with. You'll see the boat's, you know, very white, very crisp. And we'll make our way downstairs now to the main deck. And as we come down the stairs, nice wide staircase, nice beautiful dark brown flooring here, very nice. I do like, like this crisp white, white look. Anyway, make your way forward now, we've got the onboard gym. Now, Izzy was saying to me earlier that this spinning bike can actually go on the sun deck. So if you prefer to do your exercise outside, you can. But look, imagine cruising and you've got that view out of the window while the boat's cruising, while you're doing your, doing your workout. You've got some dumbbells, kettlebells, yoga mats. So if you guys want to burn off those calories that the chef will put on you during your trip, you can. We've got another day head here. So this is the main deck day head right next to the guest entrance there. Now, coming in through here, this is the master cabin. So all the closet space, space. so if you wanna bring uh, suits or dresses for every occasion, there's plenty of storage space on board. Now, the master cabin is a full beam master cabin with nice big windows, so lots of natural light. Again, lots of whites and creams, and it's a very fresh feeling on board. I can tell you, this carpet on my feet feels like an absolute cloud. It's a pleasure to walk on this walk on this carpet. We walk into the bathroom, big marble bathroom, plenty of space. Again, big windows. You've got the tiles, bidet, toilet. Here you have your walk-in shower, nice bench, and then it goes through to the other side, which we're gonna actually, you know what? Let's go through the shower. Come through the shower. And then here we've got also bathtub. So for those of you that like to have a bath instead of the shower, they can facilitate that for you. And then we come back around, we're back into the master cabin. Now, although you had that closet space I showed you as we walked in, you got an additional walk-in wardrobe, unlimited space for, for all your clothes, your items, your equipment for your holiday. And that's the master cabin, guys. Okay, we're gonna make our way out the master cabin 
and then we'll go down to the lower deck to the other guest cabins. So the first thing I noticed coming down here is how wide this staircase is. The use of space on this boat for a 43 meter is actually really well thought out because most of these hallways tend to be very narrow but they've made this nice and wide. So we make our way into so the cabin, the, the lower guest cabins have been divided into colors. This is the blue cabin. So this is the, also known as a VIP. So nice big double bed, you got your flat screen TV, Sono stereo system, plenty of space for all your clothing and storage. And then we come in to the VIP bathroom. You got the bathtub as well, but not only the bathtub, also have the shower. There we go. Nice big shower in there. Plenty of space. I like how solid everything. All the doors are wide. It's thick. It, this boat feels very solid and well put together. That is the blue cabin, guys. So we'll make our way back out. And as we go through, we're going to go into one of the twins. Now, this is the aqua cabin, which is a twin cabin. Good space. Nice beds. This cabin also has the, the Pullman. Um, I do like the fact they've used um, colors as a theme in the guest cabins here. So plenty, again, plenty of space. Remember for a boat this size, these cabins are actually really big. All the closet space you can need. And then we'll go into the aqua room bathroom here, the mosaic tiles, your bidet, toilet, and then you have your shower. And obviously all the guests, you get all the toiletries, dressing gowns, hand soaps as you expect on a chartered yacht of this caliber coming across we'll walk straight across into the coral room and you can see it is identical to the aqua room with the pullman but just a different color theme and again bathroom is pretty much the same toilets bidet and the shower and we go into the final cabin and this is also a double a vip and uh, like the aqua room this is known as the yellow room the difference being obviously they have the pillars for the the beds plenty of closet space big vanity tv comes out of here so you can watch your tv again sonos music plenty of room you know, I keep, and I keep saying this, but for a 43 meter, these cabins are actually huge. And then into the uh, Yellow Rooms bathroom. Again, nice bathtub, plenty of space. I'll do a Nick from Aquaholic. Hey guys. And then we have the, the shower. Guys, so that is the four lower guest cabins. And so what we're gonna do, we'll make our way back out and back up the stairs onto the main deck you may remember this is the day heaven main deck that's the gym that's the master but we're going to make our way aft into the main dining room now the main dining room you can sit up to 12 guests you can see it's a very grand dining table what a grand place to be again the the white you know features flow throughout the boat i like the use of mirrors as well it gives it a lot more airy spacious Feel here on board and then we continue into the main salon now this has a really homely feel to it it's not clinical it's a really nice place to be you feel welcome here I love this chess table here I think it's it looks it looks great it looks traditional it looks well used which I like nice very comfortable sofas big tables very nice place to relax after a day on the water to get out of the sun for a bit then we've got a fully functional bar here so in the evenings you can have your pre-cocktails and the stews on board will serve them to you as you enjoy maybe a game of chess or you can be relaxing right out here onto the main deck aft again nice seating area very relaxing very beamy this boat and then finally we'll make our way down to the swim platform where we have the boat's bosun and that's neil and neil welcome to the video neil is going to tell us a bit about what the what water sports Bina has on offer and what the guests can expect yeah sure so this is the play area obviously this is where we have all our fun on Mariot Pina. 
So I'm responsible for the fun on board. So we have a selection of toys. We have our two sea bobs, which the, the guests generally love to go out on little excursions. You can go do some exploring in caves and uh, on shore. And you're welcome to, to have loads of fun on that. And then next we have the e-foil. This is one of our latest additions to Mario Pina. We have a well-trained crew who can assist our guests in e-foiling. I would say this is probably the, the jackpot of the boat. Inside we have all our inflatable toys. So once we're out at anchor, we normally have a nice little setup here with chairs and a little table. The guests are welcome to sit here and have some, some beverages. And then we also have our stewardesses that love to serve the guests some snacks and some, some drinks on the inflatables. Generally, once the guests are done relaxing and playing on, on the toys on Bina itself, we have a tender as well, which we use for towing. So we have a variety of skis and tow toys and of course the towable inflatables. So the, the biggest favorite for the guests on board Made Bina is the slide. So we have a lovely big inflatable slide that comes off the starboard side of Bina. So the guests would go all the way up to sun deck and they will have three decks going down and plunging into the beautiful blue Mediterranean ocean. If you're interested to learn more about Moti Yacht Bina, I'll put some links in the description box below. She does have availability for this 2022 season for charter. So do get in touch. You can contact us at info at mortlock-yachts.com should you have any questions. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you to the team for putting the boat together, getting it all charted ready for this video. So be sure to thank them in the comments box below. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you next time. See you and ciao.